What's up everyone? Welcome to your Back to Basics Leg and Glute Strength Workout. We've got 30 minutes of work today and we're going to rock our big basic movements. Squats, lunges, deadlifts, and glute bridges. So grab your dumbbells and let's get started. Alright, let's go. Heels to glutes. Open up your hips. and Let's open up the quads. We've got a low impact workout today. Rocking through our big basics. What I want you to do is think three rounds. What's my best weight? that I can do for each exercise. Start one dumbbell below that for round one and then progress as we go in either round two or round three. All right, hands on the hips, let's hinge it back. Good, up and back. There you go, three, two, and come back up to the top, reach your hands out front, slowly drop it into a squat and stand. There you go. Nice flat feet. You want to make sure your knees drive out. One more. And it down into a pike position. Heels are down. Good calf stretch. There we go. And exhale into a plank. Drop your hips open your chest. And lift it up top. And one more, drop your hips, open your chest. Great job, widen your feet out just a little bit and walk it on back. All right, let's go side to side. We're starting off with goblet squats in just about 20 seconds. Okay, dumbbells up front right here. Make sure you keep it nice and close to your body. 45 seconds, two seconds down, two seconds up, okay? All right, let's get it. Four, exhale, and round one, here we go. Chest up. Hips and chest rise together. So don't get to the bottom and then let your hips scoot back and then roll up. Sit, chest up, drive down. Good job. Dumbbells touching your chest. 15. Good job. Two, one. All right, round number two. If you can go heavier now, let's do it. If you felt that was pretty challenging, stay right here. Then round three will go up, okay? All right, two, one, let's go. Good reps here. It's not about speed, it's about depth, it's about resistance. Back and down, chest up, drive up. Good job. Come on, let's go two more. You got three. All right, one last round right here. Be honest with yourself and push yourself. Ready, four. Two, one, come on. Keep the breathing going. Don't let your back round. Yes, good job. 15 more seconds. Keep it tight, keep it tight. Eight. Three. 
and breathe. Romanian deadlifts, okay? We're going right into it. 10 seconds, you're right here. All right, five. I'm just gonna hold one dumbbell here. Two, let's go. Hinge it back. Good. At the top, I need a big exhale. Squeeze the glutes to neutral, not hyperextended, okay? Great job. As you exhale, you're going back and you're standing. Always think of digging my heels into the floor, thinking about ripping my mat apart with my heels. Like I want to create a tear right between where my ankles are. Breathe. Good job. Heavier if you can. Round number two. Ah, all right. Keep it up. Two, one, come on. Back is strong. Exhale is great. These are squeezing all the way from the back to the front. Don't wait until you get to the top, then squeeze. Six. And breathe. One more round. Then we go into reverse lunges. Then we'll take a longer break, okay? Here we go. Three, two, Turn it up, come on, round three. Nice job. You got 15, let's go. Two, and breathe. Three rounds of reverse lunges. Dumbbells are right here. Okay, then we take a longer breather. I'm gonna start with my 15s. Ready? Come on, let's rock it out. Basic movements, don't rush. Good job, exhale. If you need a break on your hands, you can rack your dumbbells up top. Two, one, good job, round two, let's get it. You know the drill. Breathe, take your rest, but go up if you can. Four, doing good, let's go. Back is strong. Breathing is consistent. Knees are not caving in, okay? So make sure you don't get here. Driving in, okay? You sit, keep it out, okay? Come on, one more, three. 
Good job. You got one last round here. Yes, I need you to go up if you can. Whew. Five, come on. Crank it out, let's go. You and me, finish strong right here. There you go. Keep this breathing up. We're gonna head down to the floor for our next circuit of three exercises. Okay, three rounds of each one. 15. Good, come on, five. One more. And breathe for 30. Great work. We're taking it down to the floor for glute bridges. Three rounds of glute bridges, okay? Make your way down. Same thing, 45 seconds. I need you to grab those challenging weights and some water, <laughs> okay? All right, here we go, five. And we're off. Up for two, down for two. Good, when you get to the top, drive your knees out just a tiny bit and squeeze that bottom glute together just a bit harder. Feel that connection? That's what we need every single time. Come on. Good, breathe. Evaluate if you can go heavier. I don't need you to do that, you need you to do that. This is how we get stronger. Bigger challenges, good form, good resistance. Round two, ready? Let's get it. Good work, good work. Exhale. Don't forget the breath. And if you need a little bit more of a challenge, rest less at the bottom, in between those reps. Good, five, four. Breathe, amazing. You got one more round and then we're gonna stay down here on the floor for Superman after this. Whew. Great work. Four, ready? Big deep breath. Good squeeze here. Squeeze it with everything you've got. Let's go. Yes, good job, come on. Seven, come on. Breathe, drop that dumbbell, flip it over. We're going Superman, okay? Long, stretched out body. All right, I need your legs driving up with a glute squeeze. Let's go. And if you're able, you can hold a dumbbell at your chest, but I want this to be mainly a glute squeeze and a high heel lift. Good job. Strengthening your lower back here by lifting your chest up. Exhale, go.
Good. Think up, two, down, two. One more. Up, two, down, and rest. Good job. Breathe. Make sure when you're lifting your chest, you feel your lower back pushing your hips into the ground. Focus hard on these, okay? Three. Let's go. Chest up, heels up. Glutes are squeezing as hard as they can. Good, don't worry about looking up too high. I'm looking at the floor and then when I come up, I'm just looking in front of me, not up to the sky. Good work, 15, harder squeezes, let's go. Five, up, 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 let's go. Rest, and you got one more round right here. Hard squeezes every time. Squeeze so hard you think, I can't squeeze harder. Then relax and do it again. Okay? Three. Let's go. If you really think about that tempo of two seconds to get up and two seconds to lower, you're gonna feel this a lot more. Good. Keep breathing. Eight. Three. Beautiful. Come on up and we're going sumo squats. Okay, I want you to take the big weight that you used for your glute bridges. It's on the floor. Okay, think of a sumo deadlift. Wide feet, right here, and stand. Two, one, let's get it. Good, set it down, drive again. And if you're not able to get to the floor with your range of motion without rounding, just keep it right here, okay? You don't have to touch the floor. Right before I take off, you're gonna see me tightening up my lats so my shoulders aren't up towards my ears, they're down towards my back. Like someone's about to tickle you right here. Lock it in. Breathe. Great work. All right, round two. Same thing. If you can go heavier, you gotta do it. If that's two dumbbells, that's fine. Let's go, come on. Good, lock the lats, then lift. When you lock your lats, your hips don't separate from your upper body, right? Because then our lats are not locked. Lat is a big muscle right here in your back. Squeeze it. Chest and hips rise together. Good, rest. Woo. One more round of those, then we get our long rest, okay? All right, let's get it. Four. Come on. Come on, you're doing great. A little breather if you need it. Stop and breathe, just don't stop and leave. We're here together. We started together, we're finishing as a team. 
12. One more. Breathe. 30 seconds to rest. All right, we're going. Forward lunges, okay? If you're not able to step forward and back right now, I want you to step out, squat, okay? Step back in, squat, okay? We'll get there. Just a single leg forward momentum movement. Ready? Let's get it. I step out and I think my heel goes first, then my toe, so I'm here, here. Then I sit. Then I'm keeping my knee out. Okay, so when I step, it does not cave in at any point in the lift. If you can touch your knee to the ground, do it. Perfect. Two more rounds. I'm gonna grab some water. Let's keep it up, okay? Basic movements, but a strong you. Let's go. When you lunge forward, don't let your dumbbells swing, okay? Lock them in by your sides. So you get out there, you sit down, and you're not trying to recover from your dumbbells whooshing forward. Feel the difference? You control the weights. Yes. Great job. Six. Breathe. Whew. Come on. Can you go up? Try it. Be about it. You can do this. Come on. Big deep breath. Finish strong here. Two. Control the weight. It does not control you. Come on, you're so close. 15. Two, one, breathe. We move on. Last round here. You can go heavier, you gotta do it. Come on, step it out. And then we finish with one last move. <sighs> 25, I know this feels like a long one. You're doing fantastic. Control the weight, sit. Don't worm back up. Okay, so don't get down there and think, uh-oh, this is hard. And then try and take your head back. Stay there, depend on your front leg. Push, four, two, breathe. You got a squat hold. All right, let's finish it out right here. I'm gonna put my back against my dumbbells. You can put your back against the wall or just hold a squat right there. Two, one, let's go. Your tailbone should be back against the wall, the dumbbells. I'm not sitting on my dumbbells. <laughs> I promise there's nothing under me. My weight 
is in my heels. Good job. Fifteen. Six, come on. Basic isometric hold here. Rest. Good job. You can be against a wall. You can also go up to something. Kind of make that your target and touch. Okay. Round two. And we're seated. There you go. I don't want any of this. Okay, if your forearms are on your legs, lift them up. High five. Come on, dig your heels down. Now see if you can wiggle your toes for me. Let's do a little bit of distraction work here. I know, I know how you feel. I know you're strong enough to get through this, come on. Good job. One more time through. Ready. We go in six. Four. Come on, exhale. Two, one. If you can hold something weighted on your legs, that's fine. Putting it out here won't do anything for a challenge aside from putting weight from your knees down to your heels, right? Which we're pretty stable there. You put it here, that's where the challenge will be, okay? If you're working on strengthening your back right now, if you hold a weight at your chest, that will be a good challenge for your back to stay strong. 15. Come on, 10, nine, five, Hold, 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 three, two, one, and breathe. Whew. Breathe, we've got one more round. All right, little bonus round, do grab something. Grab a weight, grab something, two, one. This is it, a little surprise finisher. I know, haven't done this to you for a while, so I feel like we earned our trust a little bit and I just broke it, but finish strong right here and we are done. And it's all to make you stronger, okay? Sometimes you'll go hard and you'll think, I just gave all I had, and then I challenge you to do a little bit more and you surprise yourself. Okay, a lot of times mentally we think this is our limit. Physically your body's like, listen, we got you. Okay, come on. You can do this. We are in it together. Wiggle your toes. Up, down, up, down. You got four, come on, three, two, and breathe. That is it, you have made it to your cool down now. Come on down, drop to the floor, hands and knees, exhale, back. Good work, lift, come on forward, up, 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 up with the chest. Beautiful job today. Our big basic movements. That's it. Switch it over. Perfect. Toes wide, lift your hips up, walk it back. I hope you felt strong. A lot of strength work is sometimes going back to the basics and showing yourself. Here's how much stronger I just got in this last week, month, two months of programming. Exhale, roll it up. And if you're finishing this workout thinking, ah, probably have a little bit more in me. I challenge you to invest in some heavier resistance, whether that's glute bands, it's heavier dumbbells, it's maybe the adjustable dumbbells, kettlebells, okay? Maybe asking for them for your next birthday, holiday gift, just saving up, whatever it might be, I promise it's worth the investment. 
switch it over. And also, this is a workout that you can take with you when you travel. So if you're going to a hotel gym, you're going somewhere where you know there's at least a couple heavy sets of dumbbells or a barbell, you're going out of town, you can visit a new gym outside of your hotel. Take this one with you. It's your big basic leg moves, okay? Push forward gently. And as we made it to the end of our cool down today, I am so proud of you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for crushing it with me. And I will see you back here for our next workout. Bye everyone.